some reason it keeps forgetting my audio settings. So I'll reset this again so I can... The Age of Darkness without light. Creatures who wandered this world were later called monsters by humans. They were feared by everyone. No one knows where or when or how these creatures came to be. Have they been here since the start of humanity, or were they here since the start of time? Who's to say? Time passes. One day, there was a change in the world. A great beam of light struck the earth and diffused through the darkness, filling the earth with light and destiny. Most of the monsters had no existence to light and quickly perished. A seemingly endless period of time passed. Humanity had evolved and dominated the Earth's surface. Monsters did not become extinct. They hid underground and increased their numbers. As if they were waiting for the moment of restoration. Our story begins when the monsters reappear and the inevitable Conflict between man and monster ensues. So this is Crusader of Sinti. I just assume that's how it's pronounced. played this game before. <laughs> and now the moment you have been waiting for, a birthday party for Fox. Thank you all for being here today. Happy birthday, Fox. You are now 14 years old. I have a present for you. This is a sword your father used. He was very strong and kind, but he lost his life in battle. I really don't want to hand this sword to you, but it is the law of this land to hold the sword and go to battle when a boy turns 14. This is some pretty impressive pixel art on the main character. Like, I don't think it's coming across very well on my 30 FPS stream. But it just, it's just really smooth. Just trust me that it's smooth. Well, it's a sad tale, but try to honor your father's intent. Wow, I want a sword too. I can't wait till I hit the big 
one four. I have a sword too, not a rusty one like that, it's a brand new sword. Happy birthday, Fox, that is a beautiful sword. Huh, fireworks? Is someone leaving today? By the way, it's the day Brave Amon leaves, let's go see him. Don't forget to give me a send-off too when my turn come my turn to go comes, okay? Oh Billy, becoming a hero is not an easy task. You'll never become one if you don't train yourself at Rephalasia training ground. Come on, hurry. I like them on. I like all strong heroes. Just wanted some of that cake, not to progress the story. Okay. lot about this game other than it is more or less a Zelda clone but instead of getting like items in dungeons or whatever you get animals you can easily lose your life at the training ground too as well as the treasure chest there are also coins hidden under the grass shape of Dahlia Valley is very complicated. There are monsters too, it's not a place for a kid like you, even if you have a sword, don't go there. Still gonna, I assume. I see you've grown old enough to carry a sword, Fox. Now have you heard about the medals? The training ground consists of beginning, intermediate, and expert courses containing bronze, silver, and gold medals. Collect and take them to the castle. The king will exchange them for the holy sword, the true sign of a hero. And all this partial transparency would look much better on an old CRT. Here, people no longer visit. We must have peace with all creatures and bring harmony into people's hearts. Some great proofreading there. The way a single word stretches multiple lines. So what I do know about this game is the gold apples like you see down there increase your maximum health. I don't know if they act like heart containers or heart pieces. I think I've already been in here. Isn't the castle up ahead? I'm waiting for Amon. I want to give him a send-off. Being a hero is every man's dream. I'm sure Amon will be a great hero one day. Fox, I think you should report to the king about your 14th birthday. Dahlia Valley is a weird place where the monsters keep appearing. You should learn how to throw your sword at the training ground before you go. Well done, Amon. You have passed the trial. Here is your reward. Thank you, Your Highness. This sword will be a great encouragement. 
Your journey will be a long one, but I expect you to do well. Good luck. Yes, your highness. That sword, you must be Fox. Yes, it has been a long time. Your father was so brave. He saved this town many times with that very sword. Enough old tales for now. You have come to report your 14th birthday, have you not? I will grant you the right to train at the Reflexia training ground. Train hard and train well. Reflexia is a training ground to become a hero. Train hard and well. So yeah, that's... I guess this game's gimmick is that you can just chuck your sword like a boomerang. How busy I am. Hey boy, don't go near the fireplace, it's hot. Ow, that actually took away health. Well, I was not expecting that to... Oh well. You can also jump, unlike Zelda. Well, I guess most Zeldas. A few of them, you can. But I think I need one of the animals to do that. This is a prison for monsters who wander into our village. We are using them for research. I think we should just waste them. I really hope that was not the toilet. <laughs> I was not expecting to be able to walk into that. I saw him on leave. He looks awesome. After all, he's the hero. I used to practice my jumps near the lake north of Dahlia Valley, but I'm scared to go there now. It's the territory of a very hot-tempered rabbit. You can try negotiating with him if you can talk to rabbits. So I'm pretty sure I get that dog at some point. I think something happens in training and then I can start talking to animals. I think a long time ago I kind of watched, air quotes, a speed run, like just something I had on in the background. So I have a vague idea of what happens in this game. Oh, and I mentioned before in one of my playthroughs that I have, that I use, uh, Retro Achievements. You must be Fox, I received a message from the king, you may enter. Yeah, it's been kind of an incentive for me to complete my backlog. Although I don't particularly care about hunting the achievements down. I'm an expert at sword throwing. You are very you are, you are very lucky, my boy. You can buy the sword throwing skill for just 20 malins. Hmm, it looks like you don't have enough money. Come back when you have some hard cash, son. Hey Fox, did you go to the plaza just west of Solil? That's it, we're warriors. There's no time for us to play, right? I'm the instructor. You know the purpose of this training ground, don't you? Then give it your best. Slash the red switch to light the fuse. Okay, so that was not it.
was not actually expecting to be able to cut those things. something in them too. So far they haven't, they've just been an obstacle. Expect for four digits of for the money that I would be getting it more often. Actually, that was a mistake. expert at sword throwing, you are very lucky my boy. For a limited time the sword throwing skill can be yours for just 20 mountains. What do you say? Abra Abra Cadabra. Fox learned how to throw the sword. Hold the A button to accumulate power and let it go. You can throw your sword. So I mean I guess this is different <laughs> from Zelda but Zelda also has sword beam, so not too different. Not a single coin from any of that. jump across by using the accelerated jump, jump just before the cliff. So I don't have either of the abilities that I need for that. seems to be pretty rare so far. I am assuming that enemies will drop more. The grass has been a disappointment. Okay, I was not expecting to come from the bottom there. Hitbox on the swing is going to take some getting used to, it looks like. Let me 
need some new ability for those things. Not a single coin since getting that ability. You can step on any red red button with a circle by jumping on it. Yeah. I'm just going to give up on cutting the grass for money. That just doesn't seem to be happening. It doesn't look like I can do anything here. This is probably where I went before. North of that building. That's a really slow way to get infinite money. I was expecting that to go further. The chest respawn too. Okay. Must be new here. Let me give you some advice. You must learn the running jump on your own. You can't learn it here. It seems we can only complete the beginner's course. Let's take it easy. Okay. hit something that it can't go through, it does not cut anything on the way back. That's weird. Also, still seems a little loud. Huh, okay. I was not actually expecting to be able to enter the water. bronze metal. Okay, so the crates can have stuff in them.
And of all the things I can't break, I cannot break the pot. I don't know how to trigger the blue ones. I guess you run into them from below. Yeah, I can't go back through those. to take the medals to the king. Nope. So apparently the bronze one means nothing. I assume that I don't buy it and someone else does and moves in with a shop or something. I don't think there's anything else I can do in the school. cut rocks too. Because there's just certain things it seems to be hard to cut. Or hard to hit, I mean. Huh, don't know how to get to that. no enemy has dropped anything either. Oh, let's get the need to find something to climb that. But I guess I don't need to climb it. expect that to hurt me either. There's a lot of things I guess I need to get used to in this game. Oh, okay. Oh, so that must be how I get to some of that stuff. That didn't seem to help at all. I would have expected that to keep going with the wall. So far, the bees have been the only thing that were hard to really deal with, and they couldn't even hurt me.
So I assume the, that rabbit lets me jump. But since I can't talk to the animals yet. It's also good to know that things like those crates with the apples in them respawn just going in and out of the map. If I ever need to refill a lot of health. Or get more money. Okay, I can't get through there either. Okay, so I can't do anything here. Unless there was somewhere along the bottom that I didn't notice. There's nothing I can do there yet. The only thing I can think of is... I could try the lake. But I think the only... Uh, I'll try the... No? Okay, no, I can't try the lake. So the only place to go is a school. Let's see if this guy has anything more. I also don't think the shield does any good. But Link has a shield, so this guy needs one too. Probably shouldn't be over here if I'm not one-shotting enemies. <laughs> Okay, I guess I am. Oh, so I can't go anywhere. So this is not where I need to go. There's gotta be something back in town then. I don't think there was anything else, or anywhere else, there that I could go. Now I'm hitting them with no problems. Well, some of them. I think it's just a really small hitbox. So far, it does not appear to be random if things give me money. And I guess there is a slight difference in these, the ones that you can and can't break. I don't 
think I went to the right. And then you pop out from the... Okay, so I can't go there either. So yeah, then it's gotta be something back in town. It may be important to train yourself, but why don't you rest at the plaza at the west end of the village? So that might be where I need to go. Well, I'll talk to... I've seen you've grown old enough to carry a sword, Fox. Now have you heard about the medals? That wasn't anything new, I don't think. Moo Moo. I don't know what I expected. My sister is in Dahlia Valley. Her son is at the training ground. Everyone is in a dangerous place. I can't go home because I don't have the skill to throw the sword. see anything in the valley where I needed the sword. You've already got the bronze medal. I'm proud, but be careful not to strain yourself. At least someone cared that I got it. you got the bronze medal. For a young boy, that's pretty good. So I guess we'll check out the plaza. If I can figure out how to get to it. I guess those are enemies. This is a plaza for kids. Why don't you join us and play? Fortune teller at the plaza is pretty accurate. But she's off today. That's probably where I need to go. Would you like to increase your maximum hit point? I will sell you one hit point. But it's but it is cost Okay. 800 Malins. This may sound rude, but you don't look like you can afford it.
don't have to just point to those holes. House of Fortune if you wish to change your fate. And I can't go in there. Okay, so this is probably not where I need to go then. If I don't figure something out soon, I guess I'll have to check a guide already. Side. You made it sound like the sword throwing. Oh, I bet I know what it is. Okay, I think I know what it is. But those places where I could let the water out, I probably throw the sword to them. out of the fireplace, so I will eat you instead. Grr. Oh, okay. Ow. Oh, I am hurting him. He just wasn't reacting. <laughs> No, it can't be. I lost to a human. And to a mere boy. Ah, oh, poop. <laughs> it is. Box's maximum hit point increase. No, thank you. The fortune teller was just here. She told us to hide in the fireplace because a monster was coming. She also said that you would come. She really does know all. Meet her in the plaza. It almost seems like she's more than human. Okay, I see how the hood works. That apple icon shows I have a full row. saying that at the beginning that it looks super well animated. I don't think it's, it comes across on stream too well, just like the way you turn looks really well done. And the opening had a lot of great pixel art too. I don't know what 
It is, but yeah, that would be really smooth. Let me see your future. No, it's for free. Oh, you are the one who will change the fate of the world. There will be a great change upon yourself. From this moment on, you will only be able to speak to animals and plants. Seek their help and harness their special powers. You must try to see what you were not able to see before. You must lead the future. Though it may be difficult, do not give up. Now you can understand my words, just like the fortune teller. Humans have come a long way. Then you can talk to animals, too, if you can talk to me. Oh, by the way, the fortune teller was saying that she is going to Iris. You made it sound like I could only talk to plants and animals now. Can I talk to these? No. Okay, yeah, I can, I can only talk to plants and animals now. It, unless they're merchants, I guess. Sure you would. We say there's a village of animals at Anim Animone Coast. I'd like to go visit. See, so I can still read signs. Oh, Fox, how about some grub? I'm starving. Huh? Do you understand what I'm saying? Hmm. I see, you met that weird fortune teller, didn't you? Don't worry, you'll be back to normal. I'll help you find that fortune teller. Mac the dog joins the group. Let's open the window to find out his specialty. I'll bite the enemy to stop him. So yeah, that's this game's gimmick. You get animal companions. I like flowers, I can relax and be myself here. I haven't seen any way to get down there to get that golden apple. Unless once I can jump, I can jump off there. supposed to work because I can't seem to actually control them. Thank you. 
Okay. So I press the button to leave him there, and then he'll bite whatever approaches him. Understand my words? How strange. Okay. You want to go beyond here? Then you will need my help. But I will not help a human. They can't be trusted. No, not him. He is such a kind person, and I trust him, so please help. No, yeah? But you can say that because he is your master. Humans are really animals like us. Only language separates us. So humans that speak our tongue are our friends, right? Okay, okay, I'll help you. Ex excuse me and boot. Now jump. You can never do. Now you can never do it if you don't do it on your own. Okay. <laughs> Immediately into the water. So I thought I was gonna get the rabbit to be able to jump. Finally, enemies are dropping something. <laughs> or maybe just walking over the sand reveals stuff? I don't know. I can't tell what's going on here anymore. They definitely are dropping items, though. Maybe it's where the dog passes the stuff is being found? forget about the sword throwing. Easter egg up there. I don't know if I can reach that switch. Nope. Not from there, anyways.
I guess it's not really much of an Easter egg if you can see it from just about anywhere. I'm a gallant hedgehog, don't mess or you'll get burned. It's a trap! Be an animal later that does something with those. Yeah, I think that's where the dog is, has been that those things show up. Saving more often. Ramsey's animals for hire come in if you're looking for partners. You can hire your partners here, I will introduce you to them. If you have me with you, I will restore your health one time when you are in trouble. How would you like to hire me for 50 miles? I'm so glad I will return here when I've done my duty. Let's go. Okay. So I guess that's a... I can't equip it, so... Nope. So it's just, just something you have in your inventory. And Using that huge rock to block the monsters is Mr. Monkey's idea, but it was my dad that brought it here. Only my dad can move a rock that big. We have an automatic door. Others have to step on it many times. Okay. I can lift heavy objects with my trunk. Do you want to know how it is done? Okay, then try to lift that board. Okay. Through, throughout your doubt, just believe that you can do it. <laughs> okay. Fox can now lift things up. Press A in front of objects you want to lift. You can now lift it. Also release when jumping to throw the object even further. Make way, make way, make way for Mr. Bear. Can't catch up to that leopard to talk to it. I heard a voice crying out, crying for help from the other side of that huge rock, but I can't move it out of the way. I 
here there is an animal on the other side of that huge rock, but there's nothing that we can do. If we move it, we will be in great danger. I cannot allow it. There's hot lava spewing out from hot da in Hot Daisy. It's too hot to go through. top is the rock of reflection, to the right is the rock of prostration. Touch and repent. <laughs> I heard a sad voice from the other side of that huge rock. It must be an animal. You look strong, why don't you move that rock and take a look? So I have no idea what to do with those blue, blue rocks. I bet I know what I need to do. Probably need to wait for the wind to come from the right and jump across this. There we go. That's not good. <laughs> Thank you. 
Huh. As long as I don't jump, I don't get pushed off this. That's good to know. Yes. Okay. Make platforms. There's lots of apples up here. Well, that makes sense, because there's a boss. One I can't save. Who are you, boy? If you came for the penguin, I'm not letting him go. Take a good dose of the penguin attack. Now I'm now something like I heard him. Ow. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I, they just don't have any indication that I'm hurting. That, that threw me off on the first boss too. 
And other than the health appearing, they don't react to getting the damage. You, you good for nothing penguin. Max hit points increased. Thank you, I used to live in the icy island of Frisia, but we were attacked and I was captured by that terrible monster. I am forever in your debt, and I've decided to join you to help you battle the evil forces, okay? I'm going even if you say no. Chili the penguin joins the group. Depending on the other animals selected, he can protect you with the sea bark. Reckless of you. If you did not defeat the octopus, this village would have been to history. My husband may be saying that, but he really is thanking you deeply. You, I'm dropping a ton of frames. I don't know how I'm supposed to hit that. Probably an ability I don't have yet. So it had nothing to do with the dog. Just wherever I step that has an item, it'll appear. charge up my sword and it adds the penguin to it. So I guess that's what I need for a place with the lava. I went quite a bit further than I expected to. Before I get too far into this, I'm going to go to 
the bathroom real quick.